think uh, Will Smith. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, Mrs. Stratton. Hi, Justin. <laughs> Callie. What's that patch on your jacket? Good eye, Callie. You like this. Thin film solar fabric. Little solar panel runs the jacket. <laughs> what do you mean? Your pity serves no useful purpose. 
nor will it aid the many other islands and coastal people facing impending disaster. Miss Smithy, I'm deeply committed to addressing humanitarian crises all around the world, and I'm here representing our administration, which also feels strongly that. Oh, Mr. Johnson, I accept your concern, but I do not accept the administration has any interest at all. The U.S. contains less than five percent of the world's population, but consumes twenty-five percent of its energy, and is the world's largest emitter of greenhouse gas. Really? <laughs> 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 yes, and that number is going up. Well, you have not been adhering to climate treaties or reduced pollutants of any kind. Well, Ms. Kunikuzi, I can assure you, when I get back, you can assure me nothing. Action must be taken right now. And so I am here to place you as this gathering's most prominent representative of the USA under global citizen's arrest. <laughs> you can't arrest me. I have an enormous security detail with jackets. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's my birthday. <laughs> Do not worry. We are Pacific people. <laughs> <laughs> we promise to be very nice <clears throat> and sing you happy birthday. <laughs> to move to New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> New Zealand? Well, we could have moved next door to Kiribati, but after we saw Lord of the Rings. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we also have a litigation lawsuit planned, but this seemed more colorful and media savvy. Um, it is. Okay, arrest me, but <coughs> can I finish my speech first? <laughs> Mr. Stratton, I'm sure you're a very nice lady, but if you're speaking for the United States, you have about as much credibility as uh, Tuvalu has a dry future. 